City leaders in Dixon want Rita Cronwell to stay in federal prison. The city's former comptroller wants to be released right now, arguing that her health is at risk from the coronavirus. Cudrell hasn't served half of her sentence for embezzling more than $50 million from taxpayers. Dixon city leaders responded in writing, calling on the prison system to deny this release. As Local 4's Aaliyah Sims reports tonight, city leaders don't think she's been punished enough. The idea that Rita would ever consider showing her face in our great community again is, is really reprehensible. Dixon City Manager Danny Langlaws reacts after receiving an email about Rita Crunwell's letter asking for an early release from prison. If, if she were to be let out, it, it means a lot of things. It would be very damaging and devastating for our community to see somebody who stole $53 million released after only seven years. This is the copy of the letter from the city of Dixon asking the prison warden to not honor the request of Rita Crudwell after she asked to be released from prison amidst the COVID-19 pandemic. And the eight-page handwritten letter from Crunwell, she says, quote, with my deteriorating health condition and the danger of the COVID-19 pandemic, I feel like I have been given a death sentence. She needs to serve every day she was sentenced to for this crime. Back in 2012, before Crunwell was behind bars, city leaders say Dixon was on a downward spiral because of a lack of funding. In 2014, um, things changed and the, the streetscape project was uh, uh, not only became um, instrumental in making the downtown the commerce hub of our city, but it also became our, our playground. They say the last thing they want to happen is to be reminded of where the city used to be. And that was known as, you know, the city that um, had to endure the, the wrath of Rita. And, and I think we want to stay away from that. We want to stay past that. Aliyah Sims, Local 4 News. Land Gloss goes on to say the city was able to recover about $40 million as well as improving infrastructure in the city. There is no word on when the warden could, though, make a decision.